Um, yeah, that's kind of over. And so I feel like underneath all of this, like buzz and you know, hundreds and, and thousands of people walking around, it's just really a love for independent film. That's the main thing that comes through to me. But as a film festival, it's nice. I mean, you know, there's so many volunteers and there's so many people helping out. Like you said, it, it's reflexive. It seems very reflexive of this city, the way that the festival is run. I love Austin. Austin, I've been to South by Southwest four times. And I love Austin. I shot a movie here. And I love the people and food and the movie scene and the vibe. Yeah. I live here. Yeah, I... I like wandered down 6th Street and like felt really cool. All the kind of cool bars and people wearing cool clothes. Yeah, I really like it. It was nice. The movie is very much like kind of in the moment of like Greta's life and Ollie's life and my life <coughs> just falling apart. But um, the characters were written for, you know, for Greta and Ollie, so I was just riffing off of like who they are as people and so I was just asking Ollie questions and trying to get to know him and, he, and it turned out that he had all this musical talent and so I thought, oh, we could use that. It was uh, such a, like, it was really amazing to watch, to have my music, like, played up there. That was, like, amazing. So, yeah, thank you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, Ollie's been in Bright Star, the James Campion <laughs> movie. He's also in Enter Nowhere by Gaspar Noe. Enter the void. I don't know where it's actually a script I was given. Enter the void. What else have you done? No, I don't. He's a very accomplished actor. You know, Greta had done a lot of really talky movies, which I really liked too. But you know, a lot of this movie was kind of about like, let's do something Greta hasn't done recently. She had done really talking movie with a lot of dialogue and then she had to take her clothes off a lot and like I was just like I don't know I kind of was like let's put some mystery back in your body <laughs> like let's cover you and um what I, I definitely um exposed we all lived together in a house so um yeah. there wasn't it was there's not a lot of like separation between work and home mm -hmm. and it was all encompassing all the time yeah, kind of like a big slumber party, like a yeah. month-long slumber party. Get yeah. super yeah. fucked up slumber party. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to vote. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.